Hey friends, just wanted to jump in here and uh, show you how I put together a natural first aid kit for when we're out and about. I wanna talk about eight different essential oils. And uh, these are oils that we use all the time at home. But if you don't open your bottles or if you don't have them with you, they can't do you any good at home or away. So I love to put them into this keychain kit so that I can have it with me all the time. I have my reserve bigger bottles at home. And I cannot tell you how many times with nine kids, it has come in handy and it saved the day. So I wanna show you how I put it together. Um, we're gonna start with coconut oil because coconut oil in and of itself uh, is a really important thing, but it also makes all the essential oils uh, safer, last longer. And um, so it's not, it's one that's going to take up one of my eight spots in my keychain. All right, so we're gonna start with two essential oils for energy and stamina because when I'm at my best, uh, the outing goes so much better. So the first one is wild orange. Wild orange is one that um, you can use internally. So it's great for adding to your water bottle when you're out and about and the water tastes funky, <laughs> uh, but it also can absolutely change the mood of the car or um, just on your person. So I'll put a dab on my wrist, breathe it in, oh, smells heavenly. And then I'll put my wrist up to the car vent and it just fills the car with that aroma. And everyone just naturally uh, feels better. And the swabbling in the back calms down. We start laughing and singing again. It's fantastic. The second one is peppermint. Peppermint is so good at opening up your airways and therefore is fantastic at giving you a boost right away. Um, Peppermint is one that I use on road trips a lot to make sure that I don't get drowsy and I stay alert. Uh, it's great for head tension, great for digestion. Actually, both uh, wild orange and peppermint are fantastic for uh, digestion and head tension. And, um, and so they're fantastic to be have uh, on your person all the time. Use them as soon as you notice an imbalance in your mood uh, or in your uh, alertness, alert level, and get back to um, being at your best. The second two oils that I always love to have with me are for calming, calming for bee stings, uh, calming for ant bites, mosquito bites, and then just calming for emotions. So uh, they're first one is lavender. Lavender is the one that I'm putting on all of those um, itchy, irritated spots. Lavender is also uh, really great for uh, calming emotions, helping with sleep when you're out and about, like overly tired, you're in an unfamiliar place. Um, so especially when you're using lavender at home, being able to bring it out when you're in an unfamiliar place, so soothing. My son is a new driver, 17. He's my oldest. And we were coming home from a friend's farm a couple months ago and an accident happened right in front of us. I was so proud of him. He did awesome. But everyone was shaken up. The car in front of us um, that was in the accident, I was able to bring lavender and I'm bringing um, this next blend balance over to them right there on the spot while we're out and about. Our car, um, you know, was able to bring. Hey friends, just wanted to jump in here and uh, show you how I put together a natural first aid kit for when we're out and about. I wanna talk about eight different essential oils. And uh, these are oils that we use all the time at home. But if you don't open your bottles or if you don't have them with you, they can't do you any good at home or away. So I love to put them into this keychain kit so that I can have it with me all the time. I have my reserve bigger bottles at home. And I cannot tell you how many times with nine kids it has come in handy and it saved the day. So I wanna show you how I put it together. Um, we're gonna start with coconut oil because coconut oil in and of itself uh, is a really important thing, but it also makes all the essential oils uh, safer, last longer. and um, all right, the next two oils that I wanna to add to our natural first aid kit are oils that are gonna address cleansing and immune support. When you're out and about and you notice like your glands are swollen or maybe your throat starts getting uncomfortable, that's when you want to act. The first sign of when something is, is going wrong with your immune system, right? Not when it's getting out of hand. So having On Guard essential oil to your natural first aid kit and tea tree essential oil to your natural first aid kit, super important. Uh, those oils are also gonna do double duty for um, helping with any kind of Band-Aid situations. Uh, and then putting some natural uh, ointment in your kit too is fantastic. I would love the correct X. But think about all those times when you need a really quick um, um, cleansing boost dirty hands, nasty uh, picnic tables, or uh, the tray tables for the, the kids' uh, high chairs. Gross, right? So a, a little drop of the On Guard or the, uh, the tea tree, the Melaleuca, on those surfaces and maybe grab one of your baby wipes, swipe it down, super clean, smells amazing, smells just like Christmas, and you're good to go. But anytime that you can boost your immune system while you're out and about and being bombarded by all those new germs, super important. Um, and then at the first sign of something going awry, uh, act. Lymphatic drainage massage. You can use um, the video that I'll link below of my, so good uh, for nipping things in the bud. And then for your first aid situations. All right, and the last oil that I'm gonna suggest that you put into your first aid kit 
is something for uh, soreness. Um, kind of full circle here, when mama's not happy, ain't no one happy, right? And so nursing baby, um, lots of maybe work on the keyboard or something like that, you're sore. Uh, and so I'm going to suggest that you put in, in your oils something that helps with muscle and joint pain. I'm one too that's prone to migraines if my um, shoulder um, tension gets out of hand. So I can't wait. If I get a migraine that I'm out for a full day and I just can't do that to my family. So at the first sign of any tension in my shoulders here, I have to act. And so deep blue is something that I think everyone should carry with them um, to be able to respond to that tension immediately. So I'll dab it around my hairline, put it on my shoulders, wrists. Um, if we're out and about at a soccer game, we're using deep blue before practice. We're using it afterward. We're doing it before to minimize any kind of injury. <laughs> and then after to help recover faster. So that is one that I think every family should have. Um, in that same category of um, joint support, muscle support, and good circulation is the Aroma Touch essential oil. It's not something that I have room for in my kit, but it's something that I'm going to use before and after a long outing and being on my feet. Uh, if you've ever gotten kinkles before, you know what I mean? Like you're, you're just, you know, kind of taxed, overtaxed, and your body needs some, some help flushing stuff out. Um, especially if you've been in the car a long time or sitting, your body just needs to move fluids and the Aroma Touch essential oil blend is really great for that. So use that before you leave, um, help your feet and ankles have great circulation. And then again, before bed on one of those really long days. Good news is when you have all eight of these essential oils, you're gonna be use, able to use them in the Aroma Touch technique, which is amazing for helping um, to stay at um, the healthiest level and also to just, you know, serve your family. Um, we can learn all about the Aroma Touch technique elsewhere, but between being prepared on the go and having all of your reserves when you're home, I think you're really going to find that this is, brings a new level of uh, wellness and self-care to you and your family.